Hello and welcome back to the channel. Today I got my hands on something very special that I've been wanting to get my hands on for a while now. The Walther PDP. Compact, five inch. And I wanna thank Wayne from the Right to Arm Bears channel for loaning me the gun for the review. Thank you, Wayne. I said thank you, Wayne. You're welcome. <laughs> All right, let's get to shooting it. I was very pleasantly surprised when I started firing this gun. Talk about a smooth shooter. Wayne did mention once he attached that dot up top, which is the Hollow Sun 507C Green GRX2, that she became even a little bit more smooth while shooting. And this gun was designed with a little bit of a push out at the bottom of the grip in the front where the magwell is. The idea behind it was to put a little more tension on your pinky so you can more easily pick up the dot. I really didn't notice any difference compared to the other dots I've shot, but that is the German's logic behind that little bump out. The gun ships with two mags, each with a 15 round capacity. Sweet double taps. The Walther PDP, which stands for Performance Duty Pistol. It is rumored that the PDP will be replacing the PPQ line. The PDP does seem to be a little bit more of a versatile pistol. Anything from concealed carry, open carry, duty carry, all the way to competition. But I think she was marketed to a certain extent to law enforcement for duty carry. She does have a couple bolt cuts up front of the slide there, which makes it a little bit easier when holstering. The front of the trigger guard is textured for you guys that like to get that extra finger up front there. It also has a nice undercut, which is broadened, giving you extra surface area for your grip and it's rounded off as well. The front strap is checkered. You have raised surfaces on the panels of your grip. They're not quite finger grooves, but they do fill the palm of your hand very well. The trigger does have a safety blade, but it's one of the best triggers that I've ever experienced on a Walther. You have some slight take up with a clean crisp break and a short reset, which is very positive. The slide lock controls are ambidextrous. You have a lever on both sides and the mag catch is reversible for all you left-handed folks and she comes standard optics cut with a full length dust cover. She does come with white three dot sights, standard height. The back sight has a nice ledge to it for racking and is fully adjustable as well. And going back to that optic cut, you do have an insert within your manual that has a QR code that you can scan and Walther will send you whatever plate you need. She does have super aggressive slide cuts, which are known as the super terrain slide cuts. They're actually wider than the slide width itself. There is a little bit of slide to frame play. If you shake this gun, it does rattle, which when you first experience that, it does. it is a little off-putting, but it doesn't seem to affect the accuracy of this gun whatsoever. Now, I didn't take this gun apart on camera, but it does come apart like most standard polymer frame pistols. It's got two tabs on the side there, which you pull down and the slide comes right off the top. The machining on this gun is nothing short of spectacular, extremely clean, no chatter marks, no machine marks whatsoever. It's what we've come to expect from the Germans, right? But what's very interesting about these guns, the four inch, the four and a half inch, and the five inch is the slides are interchangeable. They all use the same size polymer guide rod with the flat wire spring, which is contained what they do on the four and a half inch and the five inch model is they put a polymer insert at the front of the slide, allowing you to use the same size spring in all three guns, which makes aftermarket guide rod and spring shopping a breeze with these guns. Did they do this as a cost saving measure? I'm not sure. I was a little concerned at first at the range that I was using the same size spring as the four inch and wondering if she was gonna cycle various different types of ammunition that I put through her. But come on, it's the Germans. They've got it all figured out. The grip texture itself is not what I would call aggressive, but I would call it, and this is a technical term, super grippy. The trigger, in my opinion, is nothing short of fabulous. And once again, it's what we've come to expect from the Germans. Yeah, I got them dancing a little bit. And I'm gonna go ahead and read the marketing pitch on Walther's website because it's pretty good. Walther's timeless innovation has once more achieved a breakthrough never seen before in firearms with the PDP Elite Handgun. Whether you are on the job or with your family, it is your duty to stay ready for any situation that may come. Now you can do so confidently with the groundbreaking advancements afforded by the Walther PDP. With revolutionary ergonomics, super terrain slide serrations, and a brand new performance duty trigger, this is the next evolution in world-class ingenuity for pistols. No other handgun can put all the tools you need at your disposal like the Walther PDP. It's a handgun specifically designed to maximize readiness no matter the circumstance. And with the support of Walther's historic ingenuity, 
it's guaranteed to surpass all expectations time and time again. The unique design offers versatile advantages when you need them most, providing supreme performance in any condition, making this the go-to choice for shooters who demand excellence every single day. As the ideal firearm for those seeking unmatched versatility, dependability, and effectiveness in both concealed carry and conventional service situations, the Walther PDP is how you stay ready. Yeah, buddy. All right, so that was a great range day today with the Walther PDP. I want to thank Wayne from the Right to Arm Bears channel. Again, I will put a uh, link to his channel down in the description of this video. Go ahead and check him out. Well, thanks for watching. If you like what you see here, go ahead and subscribe to the channel. Give me a like, and all, as always, feel free to comment. Until next time, this is the Gun Toting Pacifist. Stay active, stay alert, and stay armed.